Hey everyone, it's Karen with Yes Please Paper Crafts. And in this video, I'm going to be sharing some of the items that I picked up at the Spellbinders Warehouse Sale. And this did come in the mail today, so I'm super excited and I thought it would be fun to share it with you guys. Now, the sale is still going on. It's going to be ending tomorrow, which is Sunday. So you still have time to go out and look if you want to pick up any of these things. Now, I did check before I started the video and all of the things that I'm going to share with you in this video are still available. And uh, so that's really cool. And I have two card kits, a couple of paper packs, and this collection binder from Jane Davenport. And I am going to open all this up and go through it in detail. So if y'all want to see that, stick around. And I'm going to go ahead and get started by showing you the Jane Davenport collection binder. So this binder comes with 10 storage sheets. And I did buy six of these. The original retail price for this was $30, but they had it on sale for $5 each. And so I was able to get six of them for the price of one, <laughs> which I thought was super awesome. I love the color and this uh, aqua color is the color that I have in my craft room. And so I have a lot of plans for what I'm going to be doing with these binders. But let me go ahead and show you the one that I've already opened. I'm gonna move this out of the way. Okay, so here is the binder. Let me turn it right side up here. <laughs> okay, so it comes with this really cool elastic band, which kind of helps to keep it together, which I thought was really neat. And uh, you just kind of slide that off. And then when you open this up, it has a pocket on this side and also a clipboard, which I thought was really cool. And then it's just a regular three ring binder, so you can add your own pages. And it does come with 10 pocket pages. There are two pages that are like a full size and they have a flap at the top, which I thought was really cool. So whatever you put in there, you know, it'll stay in there better. There's also eight pages that have four pockets and this top one has the flap as well. The one here doesn't have a flap, it's just an open pocket. So there's eight of those pages. And my plan was, and there's also a pocket in the back here. So my plan is that I'm, I'm going to be using one of these to keep my scrapbook sketches. Uh, I think I'm going to use one to store my really small stamps. I have some, you know, like two by three and three by four, those smaller stamps. I'm gonna use one binder to do that. I'm also going to be using a couple of the binders to do some reference guides and inventory, kind of like the craft room inventory. And I just thought they were so pretty um, so that I went ahead and picked up six of them. <laughs> and I'm super excited because uh, I just love this design. And uh, let me show you the spine. So we have her name there, Jane Davenport. In the back of it has this design and it says, expect wonderful things to happen. And so I'm probably going to be covering up uh, the name here and putting something here that's going to tell me what's in each one of my binders. But I just thought that was super pretty. They still do have this available on Spellbinders and these were $5. So I thought that was really cool. Okay, so that was the first thing that I got. So let me go ahead and show you the paper. I think that would be, I'll do the paper first and then the card kits. Okay, so I did get three paper packs. Uh, these are all from Fun Stamper Journey. These are double-sided sheets and there's 24 sheets in each one of these paper packs. These were $3 for 24 sheets. They did also have a couple of packs that were $5 that were also really pretty. And, uh, but I just went ahead and got the ones that were $3. And there's three different ones. I'm gonna open these up and we're gonna go ahead and flip through them and so y'all can see. Now I did get uh, a pack of the paper from Spellbinders in their last warehouse sale, which I think was last year. And uh, it was super nice. I really loved their paper. And so when I saw this for $3, I just knew I had to go ahead and grab a couple of these. Okay, so this one is, is that the name? Oh, yeah, that's the name. So this one's called Playful Prince, and all of these were still available right before I started the video. I went and checked. And so this one has, I think there's six designs, and then each design has four sheets. And so the first design we have here is these is this uh, one with the little sunglasses. 
And on the back of that is a really pretty yellow tone on tone stripe. And so there's going to be four of each paper. So I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, do that because uh, we don't need to see all of it. <laughs> Let me move this over so we can see them all. Then we have this one with the flamingos. And then on the back of this one is a green and white polka dot. One of the things I love about their paper is that they have a print, but usually on the other side it's very generic, and so you could pretty much use it for anything. And so we have uh, the flamingos on one side and then the polka dot on the other side. And the next one we have here are these lanterns. That's really pretty. And then on the back of that one are these stars. I love that. That's really, really cute. Okay, so we have four of that one. And this is a very um, heavyweight paper, I would say. It's not cardstock weight, but it is a very nice weight of paper. And it does uh, have some bend to it, but it's not a thin paper. It is pretty thick. This one has, looks like sprinkles on one side. And then the other side is this really pretty green plaid. Okay, then we have a pineapple on one side. And the other side of this one is this, uh, it's kind of like a dusty pink color. Mm. Not too sure about that paper. <laughs> Love all the rest of them. Okay, then we have this really fun one with the balloons. That's really cute. I like that it has the balloon with the hearts on it. And then on the back of that one is this really pretty stripe. Okay, so those are all of the different patterns that are in that paper pack. And this one was called the Playful Prints. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at the next one. Okay, so this next one is called the Colorful Journey Prints. Let's go ahead and take a look at the patterns that are in this paper pack. Uh, this first one almost looks like flower petals in all different colors. It's really pretty. I love the colors in that. And on the back is a really uh, small polka dot in black and white. So we have four sheets of that one. And then the next one we have here is this really pretty pink paper. And on the back of that is a black and white check. And then we have this paper that has a white, almost looks like flowers on a blue background. That's super pretty. And the back of that one is a, kind of almost looks like a leopard print, not leopard. It looks like an animal print, but not really. <laughs> exactly sure what that print is. <laughs> okay, this next one is, uh, I don't know, these prints are very abstract, so it's kind of hard to describe them, but they're very pretty. I love the colors. Uh, this almost looks like a mixed media background, but it's got yellows and reds and blacks, and the back of that one is a black and white print with uh, little triangles. It's kind of cool that uh, one side is very colorful and the other side is a black and white. That's kind of neat. And then this last one uh, is this pattern with all these lines. And on the back of that one is a black and white polka dot. Okay, let's see. Do we have? Oh, yeah, we have one more design here. We also have this uh, yellow and white check. And the back of that one is this uh, really cool print that's black and white. That's neat looking. <laughs> okay, so that's all of the prints that are in that paper pack, which was the Colorful Journey Prints. Okay, so this one is called the Good Vibes Prints. And uh, it's really cool. It does have animal prints in this one. <laughs> there is a zebra. Here's a zebra print. That's really cool. And on the back of the zebra print is this really colorful heart paper. That's really cute. I love heart paper. And then this is uh, maybe, is this a leopard? I'm not sure. I don't really know my animal prints, but... It's another animal print. <laughs> and on the back of that one is this black and white stripe. So that's really cute. And then we have this paper with the plus signs. It's got a gray background. And on the back of that one is a ledger. And it's got color to it. It's gray and white, but it's also got yellow, uh, teal, and red. That's really pretty. Okay, the next paper that we have here is this geometric print with a black background. And on the back of that is a yellow and white polka dot. 
Okay, and then we have two more here. This one is a polka dot on a pink background. And the back of that one is this uh, aqua and white stripe. And then the last paper is this one with the word. Isn't that cute? And it's kind of like party paper because it says uh, make a wish, party time. That's really cute. And on the back of that one is this Tone on Tone Green Floral. So those are all the papers that are in the, the, what was that one called? The Good Vibes Paper Pack. So that was really cool. I love these uh, papers. And for $3 for 24 sheets of double-sided paper, that's a pretty awesome deal. Okay, so I'm going to share with you the card kits next. So let me go ahead and move this paper. Okay, so this first kit is from December 2019, and it's called the Hey Foxy Card Kit. And uh, these card kits are $55, but they had them, this one on sale for $15. And uh, the, they have a lot of stuff in here, and I love getting these not only for card making, but also for scrapbooking. So let me go ahead and open this up, and I'll share with you what's inside. There is this uh, sheet that comes and tells you what all is in the kit. It also gives you an example of a card that they made using the kit. There's also some adhesive, there's some pop dots, and also some double-sided tape. And you also get um, 10 cards and envelopes. These are an A2 size card and envelope, and you get 10 of each. Okay, there's also this pack of ephemera. And I'm going to go ahead and share everything in the kit, and then I will flip through and open this up for you guys so you can see what's in it. One of my favorite things about getting the card kits is the ephemera. They have such cute ephemera. There's also a paper pad. Uh, they have a stamp set. And there's also a set of uh, foam letters. Those are really pretty. It's a gold foam. It's got a white core. And uh, it's got uh, on both sides, so there's letters and numbers. There's also a die, which I believe makes a fox, which is super adorable. Uh, we have some gold sequins. <laughs> and then let's see, this right here is a sticker pad. It looks like it has five different sets of, uh, or six sticker sheets. And then the last thing that we have here is some paper. I love their paper and they usually give you specialty paper, which is super awesome. And usually it includes a mirror card, but in this card kit, there is a white and their paper is super nice. This is a white paper and then there's this light pale pink. There's a maroon and then there's a black. This is a light like sky blue, a darker pink, and this is almost like a gold craft paper, and that's really cool. And then there is the mirror card, and the mirror card is double-sided. And then the last paper in here is a white paper. Well, actually, it's not exactly white. It looks more like it's an off-white. So there's also an off-white paper. Okay, let me go ahead and show you the stickers next. This is super fun. I love getting these card kits and just kind of going through them and looking through all of the cool things that they include. So they have uh, a couple of different sticker sheets. Uh, these are not card cardstock weight stickers. These are paper stickers, but they have metallic accents. And then there's these little bitty word stickers, which I love when they include the little word stickers. And it comes in green, pink, white, black. Uh, it's like a taupe color, that's really cute. And there's also some larger word stickers and it does have gold foiling. And then there's an alphabet sticker. And then the last page here are these little circles. Those are really pretty. I bet you I can make some cute buttons with some of these. <laughs> I have a button maker, and so sometimes I make my own flare buttons. And that would be super adorable to use some of those stickers to make some buttons. Okay, so it comes with those stickers and with the uh, alphabet. Let's go ahead and open this up because you can't really see uh, all of the stamps here because their label is in the way. 
Okay, so the stamp set does have a little, I guess that, that is a fox. It's a fox. It says, you're pretty. And then there's a, a bunch of little birds here. That's cute. Okay, so here is the die. And uh, it comes with all of these pieces. And you can make the uh, fox. There's also a couple of words. I think this says, thanks. And this says maybe um, four, <laughs> I'm not sure. There's a little, um, I'm not really sure what all the pieces are on here. It's kind of hard sometimes to know what they are. This might have you and uh, it's got some branches and like little floral pieces. And then I think the rest of these uh, actually are used to make the fox. So that's really cute. I haven't made the fox yet, but that looks like it would be really fun to put together. It's got the head, the body, and like separate pieces to use for the tail. So you can kind of make it three-dimensional. Okay, so let's go ahead and look at the paper pack. This is a six by six paper pack. And it's called Hey Foxy. And then some of these items you can actually purchase just the six by six paper pad or just the embellishment pack if you don't want to buy the whole kit. Uh, they do offer some of these items separately as an individual purchase. And uh, so this is the paper. Now this is single sided paper. It does have some gold in it. Now one of the things I have to say about the Spellbinders card kits is I really feel like their cardstock is really superior. I love the mirror card, and this is a really nice weight cardstock. But their 6x6 paper pads sometimes are very thin. This is a very thin paper, but it does have metallic accents on it. So <laughs> that kind of makes up for a little bit for it being thinner. <laughs> and it's really pretty. I love the designs that Spellbinders includes in their paper pads. And so you can see here there's a black and white polka dot and a floral. This is a green stripe. A black and white with little houses. This is really cute. This looks like a basket. And uh, the rings on a tree. <laughs> I think it does repeat as well. That's got some foiling in it too. Some little bows. A floral. And uh, a green paper. This is one with the little foxes on it. There's like a pink paper, and then it starts repeating again. So there's two of each design. I do have to say, though, that I think the quality of their 6x6 paper pads is not all that great. Uh, but when you're paying $15 for this whole entire kit, I'm okay with that. <laughs> okay. Um, this one is uh, the die cut shapes, and this is my favorite part of the whole entire thing. <laughs> I love their ephemera. It's just really pretty. And a lot of times they give you two of each piece, which is really nice. And I use the ephemera not only for card making, but also uh, for scrapbooking. Okay, so let's go ahead and see if we can, if I can share some of this with you. So there's this really pretty wreath with a little cup. That's cute. And it looks like this punches out. So you can kind of separate these pieces out. Okay, we've got some florals, and a lot of these have gold fooling. So there's some flowers here, some smaller flowers. And then there's this large flower, and all of these have gold in the centers. I don't know if you can see that. Really pretty. I think that the quality of their ephemera is really nice compared to uh, the 6 by 6 paper pad. They also include a lot of little word uh, things that you can use for cards or for scrapbooking. There's a little um, envelopes here, uh, some words here that say dream. Uh, here are some uh, girls. There's two of each one, which is really nice. Here's a couple of little foxes. Those are adorable. There's also some tickets. This one says your story. And then this one says, Happy Place. I love those. Those are really cute. And they have gold folding as well. Here are some more foxes. I mean, there's just tons and tons of ephemera in here. Uh, there's two of these loves. And then this one says, Everything shines a little brighter because of you. Good times. 
Oops. This one says my happy place. There's also some leaves. I love it when they include both the leaves and the flowers. That's really nice. And here are some more smaller leaves. There's also uh, these flowers, which there's two of each one of those. Looks like there's two, pretty much two of everything. Sometimes they don't include two of everything and sometimes they do. And it looks like this one has pretty much two of every single piece. There are these uh, frames that have P.S. I love you. This one that looks like a forever stamp. <laughs> Look at all. I hadn't even shown y'all all of it. Look at all this stuff that they have. <laughs> these little bears. Those are adorable. Okay, they have more girls. This is the back of the girl with the hair uh, in a braid. And there is this one. Smiling, laughing, loving, some little flowers in a basket. This one has a little typewriter. That's cute, my type of day. Here are some larger sentiments. It says beautiful. And here are some smaller words. It says remember when and you and me. Perfect together. Some little houses. And uh, little hearts. Here's some more little words. This one says, live and grow, your special day, days. And here's some more of the stamps. There's one that says, picture perfect. I love the colors in this, in this card kit too. It's like pinks and greens, lots of gold. This one says, what dreams are made of. Some more leaves and flowers. Okay, then they included some really pretty gold leaves. Look how pretty that is. And they have some smaller ones. And then also some larger ones, larger pieces. Oops. Those are really cool. Love that. <laughs> okay, we got some more houses. It just keeps going and going. <laughs> There's some butterflies. And then also some smaller butterflies. More leaves. Uh, more words. There's lots and lots of words in here. I love this because a lot of this is not specifically card making. You could use a lot of these with scrapbooking. So I think it's awesome to use for scrapbooking. And even if you just wanted to buy the ephemera packs, if you only do scrapbooking, you don't do card making, they have that available as well. Okay, here's some blue flowers. Some more words. There's tons and tons of words and banners. Okay, and then here are some larger words that say happy. Uh, some little books that says um, an untold tale. Here are some, what do you call those? It's like the plant with the dome. I can't think of what that's called. And then some little signs that say loved. And I think that pretty much is it. They have a few more little words over here. And uh, that was a lot. <laughs> okay. So I just love all of the die cuts that come with these card kits. I just think it's amazing. And I love this little teacup. It says memories on it. And the teacup does pop out. You have to kind of pull this one apart. But that is just super adorable. All right. So let me go ahead and move this out of the way. And I will show you the second card kit that I picked up. Okay. So this is the last item that I have. This is another card kit, and this one is from January 2020, and it's called Love the Moment. This one was $20, uh, where the other one that I just shared with you was only $15. And sometimes they do have some of their card kits a little bit higher price. I'm not exactly sure why it is. Maybe they don't have as many of them in stock, and, so, um, they, and it's more popular, so they uh, don't put it at as much of a discount. Okay, so this one comes with a little card die set. 
it makes a car, I think it's a convertible, and I think that's really cool. Okay, so let's go ahead and open this up and see what all is in this one. Okay, here is the paper that tells you everything that comes in this kit. And it shows you some examples of some cars that were made using the kit. And then on the back is a project that you can uh, make. And uh, you should have everything that in the kit to make this project. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to share with you, I guess, is the stuff that's in every kit pretty much. There is the adhesives, the foam uh, squares, and then the double-sided tape. There's also 10 uh, cards and envelopes. Okay, and then the first thing that I see here is these really cool foil. Looks like um, they're leaves. I think I'll wait and open that up at the end. I don't know if that's going to make glitter go everywhere. <laughs> it looks kind of messy. We'll see. <laughs> okay, there is also this paper pad. It looks like we got some really cool designs in there. Okay, then we have the ephemera pack. And then there is a stamp set. And that's really pretty. Okay, then we have some embellishments. This looks like a pack of crystals. Those are super cool. It's uh, really pretty colors. Okay, and then there are some three-dimensional stickers. And it looks like some other stickers. Okay, so let's go ahead and look at the papers and then I will uh, take everything out of the packaging and kind of show it to you. All right, so the first thing here is the papers. And uh, we have this uh, purple cardstock. It's a pretty color purple. It looks more blue in, the, in my monitor, but it is purple. There's a silver mirror card. Oh, they gave us two mirror cards. Look at that. There's a silver mirror card, and then there's also a gold. Well, that's really awesome. <laughs> I love getting the mirror card. There's so many things you can do with that mirror card to make your die cuts look really special. Okay, there's also a white card stock. And then there's this lavender. It's a lighter purple. There's a pink. It's a, a, like a dark red or maroon color, and then there is a black. So you get all of those uh, pieces of cardstock. And I think I'm going to put this here just because that's got a glare. <laughs> okay, so let's look at the stickers next. So there is uh, these three-dimensional stickers. This first part is three-dimensional stickers, and it's got gold accents. On the second sheet are all of these word stickers, and then there are some labels at the bottom here. And then on the third page are some word stickers. This also has gold foiling. Okay, those are cool. All right, and I wanted to take these out of the package. Let's see if we can open these up so I can kind of give you all a closer look because these look really pretty. These are like fast faceted jewels. Aren't they just gorgeous? I love that. <laughs> and they ha it's like a light yellow, a pink, and a red. Those are super pretty. Okay, so we have the jewels. Okay, let me go ahead and give you a closer up look at the stamp set here. Okay, here is the stamp set that comes with this kit. It has some really pretty sayings and then this frame. That's super pretty. Okay, and then we have the die. Let's go ahead and see what all is in here. Sometimes they usually give you extra pieces, like it, it, the other one made a fox, but it also had some flowers and uh, leaves. And this one looks like it comes off, and also words. This one looks like it has words as well. So you get the car, and then you get this word, which says a moment, maybe, moment. And then there is this piece right here. That looks like all pieces of the car. Oops. There's a balloon, and then this one says the, so the moment. I think that's what that says. And then there are these hearts. There's four different hearts, and I'm thinking it spells the word love. Yep. So you have four hearts that spell the word love, and then there's this shape. Oh, yeah, that's cute. Those are balloons. That's really cute. Okay, there's the wheel for the car. I guess this is the wheel. 
I'm not sure. I wish they would give you like a parts list. <laughs> it kind of showed you all of the different pieces that are in the die. I do know that Spellbinders has a YouTube channel and they do kind of have videos for each of the card kits where they make uh, the die up so you can kind of watch somebody make the die and kind of see what it makes. But isn't that cute? It has this um, car and in the back is these balloons. They're heart-shaped balloons and they spell out the word love. That's super cute. And then the words are the moment. Love the moment. That's really, really cute. I like that. Okay, so that is the die set. And let's go ahead and open up the paper pad next. I always like to save the die, the ephemera for last because uh, to me that's the best part of the kit. <laughs> okay, so we have some paper here. There's like uh, some animal prints, a uh, marble. Uh, this is a uh, pink floral or purple floral, chevron paper, a black and white floral, polka dot, another floral. Really pretty. But again, the weight of this paper is super thin. This does have some metallics on it, some foiling. And uh, that's really pretty. I love the butterflies. And then this paper has the uh, foiling. Another black and white floral, a marble, a stripe. Another geometric print with the foiling. And this looks like a map. And then this purple paper. So I think it's going to repeat at some point. Yeah, here's the uh, the one that we started with. So that is the 6x6 six six paper pad. Okay, I'm going to open this up just because I'm really curious exactly what this is. It does look like it's going to get glitter everywhere. <laughs> but it's really pretty. Okay, so what is in this is some gold leaves, and this looks like some more leaves, and it, I'm not exactly sure, but it looks like part of that might pop out. So it looks like it's all different styles of leaves. That's really cute. I like that a lot. It's very sparkly, and just all different shapes of leaves. Those are really pretty. I kind of though wish it was uh, maybe just foiled and not glitter because I love the way glitter looks, but I don't like it when glitter gets all over. I don't like being messy. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to set that over there and I got glitter everywhere. <laughs> all right. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and look at the ephemera pack. I'm excited about looking through this. It's probably going to have some really cute things in here. Okay, so we're going to start off with some florals. Those are really pretty. That's gorgeous. I love that. Okay, and then there are some black and white florals. And then this little saying. And everything has, a lot of the stuff has gold foiling. There's some books. Okay, there's some silverware. There's so much here, I don't know where to go with it. <laughs> Here's some tags. And then this is a zebra. There's a couple of those. And it looks like this pack has two of every single ephemera as well. So here are some little plates or doilies. I'm not exactly sure. Some more little, uh, I don't know if those are books or just uh, little labels with a quote on it. Really, really cute. Every picture has a story to tell. You could really use all of these as a scrapbooking. I mean, I think it's very versatile. You can use it for both card making and scrapbooking. There's a large word. And here are a couple of rulers. <laughs> they got a mix of a lot of different stuff. Here's another one of those uh, plants with the glass dome. I can't think of what those are called. Some butterflies, leaves, and more flowers. And then here's a couple of vases. Oh, that's kind of cool. They have some playing cards. 
and the King of Hearts and the Queen of Hearts. <laughs> That's really neat. That'd be cool if you were doing a scrapbook layout where you were kind of documenting playing cards. You could use that on that layout. And then here are some little uh, cards that have definitions of Carpe Diem and Travel. Okay, we have a whole bunch of tabs in all different colors. So it looks like green and there's like a multicolor one and some purple and blue. Those are cool. Okay, here is a couple of more quotes. Some more flowers. And then more flowers. <laughs> These are pretty. Okay, we have some dice. Isn't that cool? There is cards and also dice. <laughs> That's really neat. I'm going to have to put that aside and put it in a place where I kind of know where it is. So if I do come across a picture that I want to document where I'm playing cards, uh, that would be really fun embellishments to use. Okay, so then we have uh, some more sayings and quotes in different shapes. Here, this one that's purple. And there's a lot of different little labels with quotes in this particular ephemera pack. And there's that one. Okay, then there's a couple more tags. And then more quotes. More tags. That's really cute. I think of you all the time. Okay, here are some maps. Uh, this looks like a like a Rolodex cards. Okay, we have some butterflies. And then there's some hearts. These are all gold foiled. And also some arrows. Let's see if I can pick all this up. There are gold hearts, gold arrows, little geotags. And then there's also these little black arrows. And then some purple geotags. So all those little pieces. <laughs> Here are some leaves. More leaves. Uh, and then we have some flowers. Okay, and then some more word sayings. Some tickets and some more tags so i just think that these embellishments are just awesome and uh, i love buying the card kits because uh, i love getting all of the uh, different embellishments the stickers the cardstock with the mirror card and then you get the dies and the stamps there's just so much that comes in these card kits i think it's a really awesome deal when they put them on sale in their warehouse sale and there were probably about six different card kits, I believe, that were on sale for $15 to $20. So these were just two of the ones that were available. They had some other ones there as well. And uh, that's pretty much all I have to share with you guys. So I do have a short video clip of my two dogs, Bella and Lily Bell, at the end of this video. And uh, that's pretty much all I have. So y'all take care. Have an awesome day tomorrow. And I uh, hope y'all have some fun shopping. <laughs> and we'll see you next time. Bye now. Hi, girls. <laughs> what are y'all up to, huh? Are y'all being good? Y'all had a lazy day? You took a lot of naps? <laughs> No, you didn't take a nap? I saw you snoozing. I did. <laughs> I saw y'all snoozing. <laughs> Do y'all want a treat? You haven't had a treat today. Would you like a treat? You would? What kind of treat would you like, Miss Bella? Would you like a ham treat? That's your favorite one. Do you want your favorite treat? Yeah? Do you want a treat, Miss B? You do?
You like that ham treat? Is it your favorite? It's your favorite treat, huh? Yeah, <laughs> she likes this one. Can y'all sit? Lollipop, can you sit? Good girl. <laughs> down. Good job, Lily Bell. Bella, down. <laughs> Y'all are kind of out of sync. One's doing one thing and one's doing something else. <laughs> Y'all are too funny. Okay, can you say hi? What are you going to do? Can you speak? Can you speak? Lily Bell, can you speak? Can y'all speak? Ah, you can. Ah, you want that treat? Can you say something, Lily Bell? Lily Bell, speak. Lily Bell, speak. Ah, Lily Bell, speak. You can do it. Come on. <laughs> Lily Bell. Ah, ah, Good ah, job, Bella. Ah, ah, You're just telling me to hurry up, right? <laughs> Bella. Lily Bell. Down. Good job. <laughs> speak. Okay, well, I'm gonna give you the treat now, okay? Leave it. Okay. Good job. <laughs> See you later. <laughs>